like me. So, yep, I had uh, started growing since September, mm-hmm. three months now, probably three months. Um, normally, throughout the day, it comes out. I want it to be a little bit tighter on the, the side. On the yeah, side, yeah. Cool. But we still want to maintain all that length of the bottom. Yeah, of the, right? the, the, the length of the bottom okay, is good. Cool. So I think what we'll probably do is also just clean that up. So we're getting rid of all of this bulk and then yeah. here and just have a nice strong shape running through yeah, there. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's and then we just clean up the tash off the lid. Yeah, definitely. That's a little bit off, off there. Yeah, that is well. getting annoying now. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> uh, uh, Basically, we're just going to bring everything back so we're still maintaining all the length there. You can just see what needs to go, really. You can see where the length is there, so we're just going to be following that line, just like that. What I want to do today is I'm not going to fade it underneath, I'm just going to put a line in just while we're growing this all out. And then by the time that it gets long enough, we're just going to let it grow into it naturally. You can just see, I'm just flicking into it, just keeping it very, very natural, very soft. I'm going to clean all of this underneath as well. You pretty much see what, what we need to get rid of here. It's basically just following that line there. I'm just going to flip over the comb again, set in a little line. So I don't want to put in a proper, proper line because it's going to be difficult for him to, to do that at home. Mm. So this is nice and easy for him to maintain. Right, so I'm just going to use a number three down here now just to get rid of whatever's on the cheeks. I'm going down so we can just maintain a little bit more of the, uh, the thickness and the beard. You, know, you can see I'm not going into this area too much because we want to try and maintain that length. In a good couple of months that he's been growing this, we don't want to just get rid of all of that in one go now. This is something you could probably do at home if you're finding that your beard's getting a little bit bushy on the sides. Mm. Right. Now, when it comes to the tash, because it's getting a little bit voluminous, what I'm going to do is take a number one and a half, so it's a one open on the this. I'm just going to run that down. This is going to maintain quite a lot of the length, just get rid of the thickness. It's generally just in the corners of the mouth, it'll get a bit annoying as well. Mm. Especially when you're in here because it's a different colour, you see it a little bit more. That's it, I'm just going to do the same here. It's generally this hair grows into the beard and then creates a bit of a genius boot of that hair. What I'm going to do is just gently, because I want to keep the stuff like full, you know, it graduates and everything slightly. And then just clean it up a bit. In the center of the mouth a little bit, it's uh, slightly a little bit of a slice. And what it is in the corner of the mouth. Keep the cheeks quite natural, so I'm just literally going to follow the growth pattern of the hair. There's just a few that need to come out of the, the natural line there. It's better to keep the line natural, don't go too far into the beard, obviously. Use a little bit of old money beard balm here because you'll notice a little bit goes a long way. It's on the start, you can always put more in, you can't get rid of it, right? So, start with almost like a pea size, about that much, yeah? Yeah, because we wipe that into the hands nicely, really get that down to the skin as well. This is a bit of a moisturizer as well, you can use it on the skin as well as the hair. Just work that all through, get that on the tash as well. Just kind of flatten this in the sides, you can already see the difference that it's made by the trim as well as putting a little balm in there. And then, as we say to Dylan all the time, comb it, comb it, comb it. Because he's got this very wiry beard, we're going to start training this to go a bit more straight now. Blend it here, okay. Fade it down here. Yeah. 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 Ye